We didn't even bring up the Cinemark thing, but just congratulations on that as Thank well. You. That was 168. 168. Yeah, yeah, you got it. Theaters, you guys sold out yeah. or something, right? It yeah, so we didn't sell out the entire theaters, but in each theater we would have screenings that were completely sold out, and then they would just add another screen. Oh, got it. That's, yeah. I mean, that's, that's insane. And yeah, you were the insane. first YouTubers to ever do something like that, right? There were some uh, people that like tested it, but I yeah. think that was the most successful one that Cinemark did. Yeah, I don't want to name drop here if I'm wrong, but Jack Septicai. Jack Septicai did one mm. like a month before we did. <laughs> there was like um, Yes Theory did a very oh, small that's right. version of a yeah. tour of it. Yeah, but I think we were the first people to like you know do it all nationwide. Have they yeah. hit you guys up and they're like, hey, we want to like keep doing these? Yeah, Cinemark is hitting coming you guys. again. Yeah. Wow, yeah. has anyone ever approached you for a movie? And just said, hey, we want to buy the rights to have you guys act in, you know, we want to do this we haunted have had horror special. offers before, but we've always turned down acting positions, especially in movies, and especially if it was in um, Haunted, just because, like, if we act in Haunted, yeah. how can well, we, I meant like, like... Like a docu-series, or if it's, like, them following you guys Ooh, around. That, cool. that could be different. You know, the yeah. reason why some, Sony Studios wants something, yeah. Yeah, the reason why, like, our videos are so authentic is because we are the only people that go in. Mm -hmm. Like, it's just me, Colby, a camera, and then whoever our guests are. The first time we ever had any, like, team member on was this Conjuring Andre. series because we needed someone to go get food and, like, go get the guests. We were there for a week. We were there for a week. But other than that, it's always just me, Colby, a camera, and then whoever is our guest um, because we don't want the producers, other people, cameramen, all in there because that just, you know, ruins the experience or that makes people think, oh, maybe someone's pulling a string or something. But, like, the super just run and gun, like, low budget stuff is the the whole backbone of our channel. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I and think the whole if, point it, of YouTube. Yeah. if a Netflix were to come to you, they'd have a crew of, like, 30 people. Yeah. And it would exactly. be cool. Yeah. Like, a food but truck a outside, and like, catering stations, yeah. yeah. Well, that's what I don't understand is, like, people in our comments are just like, oh, my God, these guys should, like, be on Netflix. These yeah. should be in, like, movies or whatever. And we were like... We want to be like right here. Yeah, yeah this right. is like the best never part. been a success when people try to go into more mainstream. Yeah, from YouTube. Plus, like, what's the benefit of doing like there's no benefit. Or yeah, there's money? no benefit. It's like everything that we wanted mm -hmm. is in this YouTube thing, and we have full control over it. So like, mm -hmm. we're in the best position possible. So like, yeah. why move? Yeah, yeah. It's, like, it's a happy. It's life. just the name. Like people think like, oh, they're on Netflix. Like you made it. Whatever. So for that some reason, is still there though. It is. Yeah. Yeah. There's, but that is like, a thing. Why not just throw Sam and Colby in Cinemark instead of yeah. you know, on Netflix? You know, we can just do the same things. I also think YouTube, like prediction, and it's already happening. But like over the next five, ten years, the YouTubers are going to get like massive respect because it's turning into like a TV show. Mm -hmm. I feel like everybody has their own show now, yeah. where you have to have some sort of production to like really get like a lot of views and stuff. So like I think slowly like older heads, like older people are like realizing like, oh wait, YouTube is the future. Mm -hmm. Like yeah. we should take this seriously. There was zero respect ten years ago for yeah. YouTube. But Mr. But Beast changed oh, that totally. game completely. Yeah. Like after Mr. Beast and especially the launch of like I know Mr. Beast Burger didn't do too well like yeah. now or whatever. But like when he first Feastables. like launched that yeah. Feastables, like that was huge for mm -hmm. big corporations yeah. being like, wait, he's selling that much yeah and he's that, a youtuber Prime, yeah. happy dad all like the big corporations people are taking youtubers seriously especially the power yeah 